Right, here's today's. It's rather sprawled, so I couldn't take a decent photograph. Whoa, I just mind the ground. Um, it looks like a night. We're coming down here. Let's land on this thing. And we're down. Okay, we're going to wait for daylight. It's definitely getting towards uh, night. Okay, so it's very early morning. Uh, this is another George Lucas Lied. Uh, it's called, looking down at his paperwork, Vindral Hall and Breeze Home. I'm saying that because I noticed when I took a photograph of the base computer, it didn't want to tell me. <laughs> that old bug's back again. I think it's something to do with a network issue, usually followed by a PC, Xbox player. I know he's not, so... We're going to go to this building first. Let's, uh... Not... Oh, we landed on the top. Excellent. Now then, so there's only the, uh... The, the uh... What's it called? Oh, this is right in front of me. Signal booster. Up here. Um, it's what I would class as a folly. It's just a building stuck in the middle of nowhere that does nothing. <laughs> nothing wrong with that. English are well known for it. Okay, so down one level is uh, without banisters. I really hate. They should really put a banister in there because I keep walking off those. And it's a bit bloody annoying. It's worse when you can't see your feet. So this is rather sprawled. Again, no banister. Um, we will have to work our way around and see if we can fit some sort of plan. Because <laughs> that seems to be my left turn job is out the window. And that's that. So we'll head for this one because it's right here. Uh, it's a triangular building. So everything's flopped on a triangle definitely fallen over. There seems to be some stairs inside. Uh, we will go up. We will go down. Uh, but first I'm going to turn my torch on. Excellent. I'm blinded by the light. We're going to have a peek down here. So it's obviously burrowed into this hill and <laughs> come up with a bloody great big hole. Um, there's the bottom, so I don't know if there's anything going to be actually in here. Um, if it's like his last base, he has a hole and doesn't use it. So we're going to have a quick run around, just to have a quick CC. And I uh, suspect there's nothing here. Okay, so as expected, there's nothing here except for um, the snot creatures, as you can see them. Um, I'm just going to get my way back to the entrance again now, so I'll see you back there. Ooh, that was a long slog. Although in reality, I came on the outside because I couldn't find the way out again. Um, so we're going to go over to the next one, uh, Bill, which is obviously that one with the... Uh, the beacon. Let's get up there. Here he is. So here's his electric supply. And he has a few of them. Uh, along with the snot creatures. So let's... How much power is he producing then? 36 million. Well, he's using 500,000, basically. So, a lot. Yep, a lot of bloody wattage there. A lot of watt. Okay, so it's a big... Again, folly-isk. Same with this one. It's a folly-isk. Short-range teleport holder. Couldn't get my words out on that one. Sorry for the retake. Okay. Uh, wait, where did that 
teleport game will go exactly. I uh, don't know exactly, but uh, probably there. I'm gonna head up here then. Looks like a folly again. Uh, there's abs nothing in it. Can't see anything anyway, unless it's buried. Um, and it's just a, I guess it could be used as a viewing platform. Woo, look at that. Look at the view. <laughs> so that's where the cable went. It goes up there. Uh, which is a double one, so it must go all the way over to the next one. Although it don't seem to be, it seems to be the actual house. Let's see if we can land on the roof here without actually hitting the teleport, like so. Um, or is that a teleport cable power? No, that's the teleport cable. Okay, let's... There's the diamond. There's a house there with my boat. And it seems to be going towards where those trees are so we are not so this is just a folly let's have a look inside just in case nope nothing there okay so we're going on to the next building which I completely jumped over um, okay well let's get on the roof first Okay, it's a see-through roof, part of it anyway. I it's kind of standard roof, really. Nothing wrong with that, <laughs> but um, I don't know. Wood. Get in here. Where's the damn door? Right in front of me is kind of like an ops room, really. Um, so any operations, drafting board or operations of the, any nature going on in here. Um, it has, that's where we came in, it has a downstairs, which we will get to in a minute. I need to check all the entrances and exits usually before going on. So we've got a counter with <laughs> a small radio. I don't call it a radio or a TV. Might be a microwave, who knows? Down to you. Your suggestion. The bed is three of them stuck together. Nice and cosy. Yep. They've got seated areas so they can look out and see who's approaching. <laughs> see who's arriving. And back to the ops room and now downstairs downstairs is I'm going left at the moment I like lefts is a table a, a double table because it's obviously joined and they can sit and watch the flat screen TV I guess it's a, a metal wall is it? I don't know how to use that um, it's got surround, well, not surround maybe, I don't know if there's another speaker somewhere. No, alright, it's just uh, like a audio enhanced. And here we have some flowers, so they can sit and enjoy their peanut butter sandwiches. The bushes are hanging off the wall. Okay, it's drying. It's dried herbs. That's what that's for. We've got an outside view. Uh, should we walk around just to make sure we haven't been in any? We will go around then. Because I've already, I've already started, so I'm not going to go back now. It goes back in here. So we haven't been in there. And there's a rainstorm coming, so I'm going. But it looks like... An empty pool. So you got a ensuite pool, or on site, I should say. Okay, so he's in here. We got some um, 
shelves for you to store your knickknacks. And when you get your knacks nicked, you don't want to know. Uh, we got an outside. Definitely a storm coming, I can feel it. Uh, okay. In here is probably going to be a bog. Uh, it looks boggish to me. <laughs> With laser beams to clean your, your clinkers. Sink. And a medicine cabinet, I guess. In here is a fan, so this is his shower idea again, so it's probably a shower. We're going to say it's a shower, we don't know, but it probably is. What was, where were we? We'll come out of there. Okay, going left. And... We look. Okay, it's so going left is the TV room. Oh, right, okay, we've been there. And there's a big room for doing something else in. Uh, back to the kitchen area again. Walk on the stove, fridge, and some parsley. <laughs> It's planted it in the planter. Uh, I don't know why you'd want to power it, but okay, it just lights it up, makes it look good. We've got some pots with some mushrooms and gamma weed. There's a big fire, nice roaring fire to keep you warm. I still don't like the colour change, they should have left it so we can change it if we wanted to. Still annoying, but anyway. Table looks like a lumber metal, but it's a boardroom type again. You gotta have a boardroom, you gotta have a boardroom. That's where we came in. Uh, this is under the stairs, so okay. Out here is the pool room. Okay, that's that. So, going upstairs. So I'm not sure whether I've been at... Here's the ops room. Okay, we're okay. Looks like we've done this one, even though I did get lost. There's a storm, but it's not going to stop me moving on. Well, it will, actually. Because I can't find the other one. Okay, so the storm cleared. Um, that's where we came from. Okay, so I waited till morning again. Um, I was stood up here in the dark and I was thinking, I haven't seen the base computer. <laughs> There's a couple more buildings that way that I must have skirted around for some reason. I don't know how, but there you have it. So we're going to go to uh, the next filet. Oh God, I'm stuck on, oh no wonder, I'm stuck on a bloody... Thing. We're going to go to here, then, as you can see, it's a viewing platform. It's not completely bright yet, but um, it'll do. I don't need my torch. Uh, that's where the ship is, obviously. So it's another viewing platform. Uh, we need to check underneath. Nothing there. So we're going to go over to this one. Uh, I think it's another folly style. As you can see, there's it's just a blob of building. All right, so we're up on top of it. Uh, so we got this one to go at least. That one over there to go, and I'm not sure whether I've been to there. Okay, so we're going to start by. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to go down here. Um, then if the last building is, you know, done, then I won't have to bother. I can come back and cut. Uh, right, so underneath here is held up by water ones. There 
it is. Small little build. Uh, should we check up first? We'll check upstairs first. Straight away into, I presume, in another galley. Well, oh, it's so dark. Uh, I think it's because the sun's come out in England and we're just not used to it. So there, <laughs> I've had to turn the light on. Uh, so what we got in here, we got like a bath shower unit um, with uh, a nappy changing table <laughs> and a bog. Obviously, we need bogs, but nobody else seems to need bogs. Um, and that's probably where you store your foot powder. I don't know. In here is a small bed overlooking the flight deck. You must be the flight manager. And he also likes to sleep with somebody. <laughs> okay. This is his own private, I can have my breakfast out here bar. Uh, nice jet engine thrust over top, but that's okay. There's all there is in here. It's not, it's just a small, small area. He's got gas propane. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Let's get off. Come on, down here. Oh, don't spin so badly. There's another door with uh, I don't know are we having more kitchens or is this like washing machines <laughs> you gotta wash your clothes every now and again surely uh, in here is another bath another bog nice and tidy one this one little little but tiny it's bigger than my one my real one <laughs> in here is like the meeting room or just a sit-down room for all we know. Uh, so there is that. That leaves me with uh, the flight deck again. But there is, I'm going to take the teleport up. I assume it's going to end up up there. So we're going to take the port up rather than walking. And Weems in here. There it is. I don't know where we are, but I assume that's where we are. Oh, okay. okay. Um, let's find out where this teleport just vanishes to. Oh, just fall out of that one. Oh, apparently I didn't fall ill, I fooled up. Fooled up. This is that teleport folly right so Weems up here he's got his outside pizza oven and some floral decorations on the verandi another save point loads of save points I guess we're gonna go Round first, let's just take the coordinates while we're here. Don't tell me the base name, but I know what it is. That. Uh, we got fire crystals next to the fire. That's handy. You never know. I, I, I'm guessing this is some sort of um, pool table. That's a possibility. It's green felt. There you go. Um, in here is uh, his portal uh, with another weapons and refiners. Uh, somewhere to hang your weapons is always necessary. But that's all that's over here. Right, so next to the bar is the bar. Why did that say Habitable Base by George Lucas when it's over there? That is strange. I don't know, it's weird. Not another one, is there? Nah. 
Yeah, look, it says Abdul Base. Got two pointers for a base. Uh, we seem to have um, short range teleports and a door. Uh, it keeps these big refiners out here because they obviously make too much noise. It's a superheated storm coming in. We've got a room out here. Well, at least something. And it's blocked in. So, I uh, don't know how you'd get in there, but there you go. <laughs> Does that mean we're inside a cave as it is? Ooh, I hope that's not dug out. But however. Weems there, Weems there. And we need to be find out where this goes. Oh, it goes up to this one. Okay. Uh, where does this one go? Outside of here. Okay. Let's go here and go here again. With my vision to get normalised. Um, I've got where I am. <laughs> I got lost. Oh, here we are. It's a bit odd about two of those, but so what's this? Skittles or well, it can't be nine bin bowling. Oh hmm. uh, well, it is alien, so maybe more. We're going up. Upwards is another galley. All the paraphernalia associated with at least and some spare flower pots I know um, I would hate to see what you get probed with that with but there you go in here is a vault all nicely coloured red blue green yellow silver silver black. Yeah, so unless you know what the colours mean, I guess nothing to do with me. Because I can't see what's in there for him. Uh, we have a small room with a big TV again. Not as huge as he's had before, but it seems to have two. Um, it's for those people with four eyes. Expanding gadget cube, tube, tube thing, whatever it's called. Um, and, and then another small sitting area with a veranda. Oh, nice. Uh, there's still a storm brewing, I think, so it's above the main door. Uh, but we do have kind of protection. Let's get, we get around. Well, we can get up here. Okay. Uh, in here is a bed. I don't know how to get up here at all, please. please. Um, okay, I'm confused now. Fire and a room. With another room. There's that veranda with the bedroom. Wait, didn't we just come out of a bedroom one? I know, perhaps I came the wrong way. Right, so, as you can see, there's one room, but I'm guessing it's a bath, looking like it's full of water. Good, good idea? Good idea. I like the metal sheets he uses all over the place. Tellies and swimming pools. And we're back down. And then we get out, if we can find the way out again. Oh, is it down again? It's down. I'm stuck on a chair or something. Yeah, there's that. So we're going down. That leaves us the out here. Well done. I'm going to go over the top. And 
What was stuck on? There's a ledge. Okay. Tell you this, I was only stuck on a ledge. Apparently my feet can't see where they were going. Uh, right, so this is another bill held up with scaffold-ish. There's a concrete build. There's the wire hider. There's the teleports. We tried where they came from, so we know where they came from. And here is like another operations room. Not for operations, but for military operations. <laughs> or civilian operations, but not medical operations. We've got some domes, they grow in a row. Okay. I'm getting mad. Look at these local plantage. And those that aren't local, they're in the biospheres. Okay, so we're going to go to there now. I think that's the last place. I have no idea. It's too sprawled. Wait, we got another dig out. Oh, I've got to look. I think by the squareness of it, it's been placed down with a room. Yeah, I guess I already really did some digging. And that is definitely flat. That looks like a room. It may have had a passageway. However, it doesn't matter. They're not there now. Let's not speculate. Uh, we are going over there, so we're going to take the teleport. Only because it's quicker. If I said that, and I can't even find the bloody thing. Right. Zoom. Right next to it. I can hear plinky plunk. Have I been here? I honestly can't remember. Honestly, honestly, honestly can't remember. I got a feeling I've been here. With the plinky plonk. So, plinky bonk. Just check around, just in case I haven't been here. Um. I got a feeling I've been here. Got a big pit. Check up here. Green table. Bedroom. I'm sure I've been here. It seems so familiar. And then again, if I haven't, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I tend to forget which buildings I've been to. Until I review the film and I can't. <laughs> Bugugugs. Bugugugs. Let's go outside again. Cut the film. Okay, we can assume I've either been here or it looks familiar. But I'm wandering around anyway. Just in case I haven't. If I have, sorry. And then again, if I haven't, not sorry, but confused. Let's get out of here. Night time again already, which is always a good thing. Uh, flight of stairs. I think it's just around the building. Hopefully. And there's the teleport again. There's my ship. And we'll see you later.